Hello dolls and gents and welcome to another review. Before we get started on this video, I want to let you know it is sponsored by MagSafe. So this is the Pixie Go MagSafe Wireless Power Bank and you guys are going to be super excited because I do have a coupon code for you guys in the link, okay? So I am going to open this on the uh, video with you today, getting ready to go get my nails done. We're going to use it. We're going to charge our phones. We're going to see exactly what it does. So once again, you can get the 5,000 um, 5, wattage or the 10,000. Okay. They have midnight black and Sakura pink. You guys know that I chose the pink. It's not even a question, not even a question. Okay. It is the most powerful wireless PD power bank for its size. The details are here, but once again, there is a link down below. Look at it. Oh my God, it is absolutely beautiful. It's beautiful, y'all. Beautiful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you a little bit about the item, and then I'm going to charge it because, like I said, it is nail day. There is instructions and a beautiful bag to carry it in here. I love that. I love that because it makes it very easy for me to find in my purse with it being in that bag, okay? Pack light, go fast is what it says. I'm going to pop this out, let you see on the back here, and this is it. So it fits in the palm of my hand, you guys. So if you're a woman, this fits in the palm of your hand. Do you know how convenient that is if you're out with the girls and you just want to put this in your back pocket? Or do you know if you're going to a wedding, a concert, or a show? And you just want to put this, just slip this down into that small bag that you carry. This is absolutely beautiful. So let me tell you a little bit about it. There is also a mini one. I don't think this is the mini one. So there is one that comes smaller than that. All right. It is very good for travel and use. It allows you to wirelessly fast charge compatible wireless devices up to 15W. It is ultra thin and light. Listen, they ain't lie. It's about as thick as my nail. Do y'all see my nail? It's about as thick as my nail. It is so thin and lightweight. Like, I feel like I could throw it, but I won't. Okay? It is the thinnest and lightest MagSafe power bank on the market. It allows you to charge two devices simultaneously because it also has the USB-C. So, this can charge my phone and my iPad. So, if I go on vacation, out of town or whatever, I don't have to take... Um, two chargers. You can plug this into a USB charger. Um, it will charge your phone and your iPad or anything using the USB-C or wireless pad. Okay. It supports fast charge Samsung's, iPhones, whatever you need to do. It can bring your phone from zero to 60% in just 30 minutes. Okay. This item can slip in your back pocket. In your purse, as I said before, you can even put this in your bra, women. Like, I don't know if that's recommended, but that is how lightweight, ultra thin it is. We're going to definitely test this out. And you guys know I always take you to the website and show you little things about the website and what you can find out. So this is what the website looks like. When you click the link, it should bring you here, okay? And they are showing you here that it can just fit. It goes right on the back of your phone. It can go in your pocket. It can even go in your front pocket. That is how lightweight it is. Let me turn the brightness off there. There we go. This is what it's going to look like on the back of my phone. Laying on your desk by your computer. Here is the pink one. And like I said, it comes in pink and black okay so let's go ahead and charge this baby up and then we're going to go get our nails done and i will come back and show you guys this attached to my phone and charging it did not say anything about cases but let's see oh <gasps> y'all case friendly okay that's all i need right there because you know your girl gonna have her cases right i'm gonna have my cases right I'm going to have my cases right. Case friendly. It is not falling off. It is not doing any damage. It is not doing anything. It's not charging yet because I didn't charge it. So let's charge this baby up. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So I'm at the nail place and I have my gadget here. Bear with me one moment. Okay, I have my Pixie Go here. So if you remember from the beginning of the video, I told you guys that this is fast enough to give me a boost at the end of the day. 
small enough so I don't have to debate about bringing it with me because of the space and weight and it's a quick recharge okay so I have an iPhone and I'm gonna plug it up to it because I'm going to be out today um, getting my nails done and then running some errands and I like this better than having a power bank like sticking out the bottom of your phone you know what I'm saying or a cord the other one that I have I have the bank a cord in the phone you know what I'm saying so we're gonna go ahead and put this on the phone Whoops, hold on get it around my case put this on the phone oh. okay we got this on the phone get it in the middle of the case so it's flat turn it on there is a little I don't know if y'all can see the light down there it's lit up and it's charging it's charging so your girl is I did not charge my phone last night <clears throat> you can see I have like half half a battery so it is on it is charging I'm gonna boost it one more time yeah I boosted it one more time And so we're going to go in here and get our nails done. It normally, normally takes her like an hour and a half to do my nails. I have my little pouch here when I get done with it. So it is 9.22. I should be out of here about 10.30. She ain't never on time. I'd be out of here by 11. She's supposed to be here at 9.30. She will probably get here at 9.50. And she's probably going to finish my nails like 10.50 or 11. So I will come back and show you guys how much charge I have at that time. I wish I could find the thing that... um shows you your battery percentage but i don't know where it is oh there it is battery okay so i'm at 61 percent. i just turned it on i'm at 61 percent. so we will come back after i get my nails done all right guys we're going to take a quick trip in the dollar tree still charging our phone now i did play a small game of monopoly while i was getting my nails done because i wanted to see how the charger did if you utilized your phone while it was charging instead of just letting it sit and charge so i did play monopoly while i was getting my nails done and check my facebook and check my instagram so i am still charging it i'm going to come back and show you guys what percentage we are at um, after an hour. But I just wanted to give you guys a quick Dollar Tree run with me. I had to run and get some stuff for the house um, that I needed to pick up uh, that I forgot to get the last time. So we're just gonna walk through the Dollar Tree a little bit, see what they have going on. Um, it looks like all these stores are pretty much doing the same thing. I, I don't mind that they stock every single day because that means that inventory is coming in. They're getting the stuff that we're looking for. There's still stuff that people are posting in other states and other areas that I haven't found yet. But at least when I see all these boxes and inventory and stuff out, at least I know that they're getting stuff in. So check back. I need a couple of baskets. I'm trying to redo under my sink and also trying to redo my cleaning um, supplies. So I chose two or three different baskets here. When I get home, I will figure out what's really needed or what's not needed and then um if i have to exchange anything for something else i will i'm still looking for the incense holders i don't know if y'all seen them but people were posting that um dollar tree was getting like the incense holders they're like the um i forget what you call them they're not regular incense like the dome incense um but i have checked like six dollar trees and mine has not gotten any yet so I don't know where these um, incense holders are. Um, you can put the incense in it and it's like it goes down. I'll try to insert a picture for y'all or I don't know, but I haven't found it yet. I know what I'm talking about, but I haven't found it yet. I've seen people posting it. All right, guys, so we have done some running around. Um, well, actually, I'm just leaving the nail place. It is 1043, as you can see, so it's been an hour. It's been like an hour, and I'm already at 80%. The charger is still on the back here. 80% um, is really good for me, but I'm going to go ahead and run to the Dollar Tree and different places I have to run, and I will come back and show you guys a clip of me in there. But I do have to say that I absolutely love this charger let me tell you guys 
okay this is very tiny you can slip this in your pocket front pocket back pocket it does not matter like i said before if you're like me sometimes i if i don't have a purse a wallet or anything i will slip it in my um you know we put stuff in the top part okay even this wallet here my little wallet here that i carry out day to day i can just slip that in the front part or the back part and i can have this charger with me no matter where i go i feel like this is like one of the best things that they came out with i did notice you see the little lights there um it's a little warm it's not so warm that i can't touch it obviously you know i can touch it but it is a little warm it is charging so it's a little warm but i also like the fact that i can take this off throw it in my bag and then if i need an additional charge so let me take it off and you see how it disappears i am at 80 percent so what i can do is push the button turn it off I don't know if I, there we go i'm going to turn it off and i'm going to save the rest of my charge so if later on and look at my little purse it just goes right into my little purse it's not taking up any space whatsoever and later on if i want to charge the phone again i can so thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed click the link